How's it going guys? Uh, JT Judgment here. Uh, here with uh, yet another squad for review for you guys today. Uh, today I'm going to be bringing you a League One team. So let's get straight into it guys. So as you can see, uh, we're in the 4-5-1 formation. Uh, there is quite a few in forms. One of the things that I like about this squad is that a lot of the informs in the League One are very, very good, and they are not that many coins. They're not that expensive. The most expensive, oh, the most expensive player in this team, I think, is second inform Hazard. But other than him, uh, the, everybody else is uh, a decent price for how they perform in game. Um, I will let you guys know the price of everyone what, on what I got in for. Uh, just to give you an idea on how much this team is worth. Um, for what I've got here, it's not that much. Because nearly every inform in this team, other than Hazard, like I said, is not that expensive. Um, Nene is pretty expensive as well, I forgot about him. But uh, other than those two, I think uh, everybody else is a decent price. So we start up top with second inform, Remy. Um, 93 pace. Um, very very good shot um, another thing i wanted to say as well guys is that you can if you think of it in a way you you can consider this a pace team um a lot of these a lot of league one players are pacey um that's one of the reasons why i like this squad i like my players to have a decent amount of pace um so as we go in through each player i'll also let you know what their pace is and you can um you know see what it's like for yourself so as i said we've got second inform remy up top with 93 pace uh 80 shooting uh one hell of a player guys uh got him for uh just under fifty thousand. so for, for for a player of his stats it is a decent price then over on left midfield we've got i think it's third inform nene Again, look at those stats, guys. Absolutely amazing player. He's a complete tank, really. 86 pace, 90 shot, 89 passing, and 91 dribbling. And for 67 heading, he is actually quite good at header in the ball. Um, the only downside to this player, in my opinion, is that he's left-footed. I really don't like my left midfielders to be left-footed, but unfortunately, a lot of the the left wingers in the game, like a lot of the best left wingers in the game, are left-footed. For example, Nene um, and Gareth Bale are both left-footed, but you still got players like Cristiano Ronaldo, Ribery, uh, David Villa who are right-footed. So um, we have. You've still got a, a lot of choice to have right footers on the left midfield. Over on the right hand side, right midfield, we have got Valbuena. Hang on a minute guys, I forgot to tell you how much I got Nene for. I got him for 83,500. Again, not the cheat, cheapest of players, but again, for, the stat, for stats like those, it is definitely worth it, in my opinion. Then, as I said, on the right hand, uh, right midfield, we've got Valbuena with 88 pace, <laughs> 24,000 I got him for. Again, look at those stats, guys. Decent stats. Uh, 88 pace, 80 shot. Um, I think he's got a decent amount of skill moves as well. Uh, don't take my word for it. I'm not going to guess because I might be completely wrong. But, um, yeah, he's he's really fast. He's got a really good shot on him. And yeah, that's he's one of the best right mids in the league one. That's why he's there. Then we've got two five star skillers in both centre attack and midfields. On the right hand side, we've got second in form Menes, five star skiller, 90 pace, 87 passing, 89 dribbling. What a player, guys! Um, 36,000 I got him for. Again, look at those stats. You know, you'd expect him to be a higher rated and much more than what I got him for. You'd, I, if, if it was up to me um, to guess, I'd probably guess with a player with those stats to be around about 70, 80,000, if not more than 100,000. But, um, you know, he's got the stats like that and he's only just under 40k. Uh, some of the prices of the players in this game I really don't understand, but, you know, we can't do anything about it. Then on the left hand side, um, I think he's five star skills, I'm pretty sure he is. We've got uh, second in form Hazard. Look at those stats again guys, 92 pace, 94 dribbling, that's more like it, the price 
uh, that he's worth. Again, look, um, I got him for 194,000. Um, stats like that again, guys. Look, 92 pace, 85 shot, 94 dribbling, 83 passing. Um, just what you want in a centre attack, really. Um, I highly recommend getting this version of Hazard if you've got the coins. Um, he just seems much better than his first in form or the regular version. Then in centre mid, we've got Sissoko, 86 pace, that's why he's there. And also his free kicks are absolutely amazing. Um, if you're making a League One team, I highly recommend him. He costs pretty much nothing. I got him for 800 coins. It is an absolute bargain to get a player of like him, uh, how he performs in-game for that, am uh, that amount of coins. It's just a steal, basically, guys. He will not let you down. If you get a free kick and you're using him, use him. Um, he's got a really good shot on him as well. He's just a top-class player. In left-back, we have got Inform... Uh, you've got to give me a sec, guys. Uh, Henry Bedimo Nassim. I really don't know how to say his name properly. Apologies if that's wrong. No, uh, probably did say that wrong. <laughs> but uh, 89 pace, that's the main reason why he's there. Also got 81 defending as well, which is pretty good. Uh, as you saw, I got him for 22,000, so not the most expensive of informs. Uh, pretty much every in decent inform in the game you'd expect to be around about 30,000. But um, some you can pick up for pretty cheap. And this one is one of them, in my opinion. Um, so as I said, just look at those stats. 89 pace, that's the sole reason why he's there, really. Two centre attacks. Um, I think I've got the two fastest centre backs... Not centre attacks, sorry. I think I've got the two fastest centre backs in League One. Being Mabia with 76 and also this in form with 76 as well. If you compare the stats, guys, they're pretty much average. Um, in my opinion, the only real difference in them is that Mabia is 4 rating higher. You know, um, what's his name? Uh, Abdeno. Um, I think he's how you pronounce his name. He pretty he performs exactly like Mabia. His defending is amazing. Um, his heading, although Mabia wins in, by six stat points, his heading is amazing. They're just two top class defenders. If you've got the coins, I highly recommend this in form. He only cost me fifteen thousand. That is a complete bargain for a player like him. And Mabia cost me nine hundred and fifty coins. So another steal, basically, guys. Then at right back, we've got pretty much the only decent right back in the League One, in Rod Fanny. Uh, got him for 900 coins. Uh, I think he's also the fastest right back uh, in the League One. There might be a faster silver, but um, I made the team and I didn't. I really didn't think of looking at the silvers. So that's why he's there. Um, but really, really good player. And then in goal, we got in form Hugo Lloris. I can safely say this guy's the second best keeper I've used behind Petr Cech. His saving is absolutely amazing. He saves tap-ins. Uh, he saves when my opponent tries to score sweaty goals. You know, running up the wing and passing at the last minute. He somehow manages to save those. And his diving is absolutely amazing. Then on the bench, I'll go through this quickly. We've got man of the match, AU. Uh, Centre mid sub, uh, Mavuba. This guy is absolutely... I, I can't explain how good this guy is. If you've got the coins, buy him. He's It's as if he's got like at least 10, point, 10 stat pace more than that, if you ask me, guys. He's just a tank. Centre-back sub, we've got Yanga Mabiwa. Striker, um, Obama Yang. Centre-attack, Utaka. Right-back, uh, Debuchi and right-mid, Sako. Then on reserves, we've got a goalkeeper sub in Info Mandanda. Left back sub inform Tremolinas. Centre back sub inform Diawara. Centre attack in mid sub inform Munier. And left mid inform Petroipa. Okay, guys, that was my League One team. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, my next squad is going to be a French team. Um, I've already made it. It's ready to be uploaded. Um, I'm just going to, you know, play a few games with it so that I can tell you guys what the team is like when I make the video. And that's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Um, don't forget to leave a comment down below. Tell me what you thought. And also, if you haven't subscribed, I'd really appreciate it if you subscribe as well. I'm thinking of starting a new series. If you haven't watched my previous video, go to the end credits and it'll tell you more about it. Um, 
and that's it guys uh thank you for watching i will see you guys next time peace